Good Friday morning to you. Yes, you made it. Happy Friday to you. Mm -hmm. <sighs> I hope you have a pleasant weekend, whether you do uh, decluttering housework. Make sure that you take some you time, okay? Deal? All right, I'm certainly going to. Not a lot, just even a, a little bit of time for some for a creative outlook, like cooking or crossword puzzle or what have you. Uh, we're going to whiz through today's content so we can get you your Friday funny in about four and a half minutes from now. We're talking about decluttering toxic relationships this week. That's right, friends with no benefits, or they can be family. Um, <clears throat> many times your, your worst sabot saboteurs can be at home where you think that you would be getting some support. And it can be either overt constant criticism or just little subtle digs yeah or um could be advice advice given in the name of helping you to improve my dear mm -hmm. yeah <laughs> they, um, because i care all right and forget about getting any attaboys hey good work you know and have you considered do adding this <laughs> Ain't gonna happen there. I've been through. I've been through all of this, uh, or perhaps it's happening at work. You feel bullied at work. Uh, maybe your your coworker is appears to be supportive, but is actually forgetting to tell you that uh, you're 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 a waitress, and oh, forgetting that we're out of sour cream. Okay, well, this is this will be good to know before you go to the table, uh, telling them that they need that that uh, yeah anyway, uh, or forgetting to tell you that you have an appointment. Your secretary forgets to tell you that you have an appointment, mm -hmm. right? Anyway, or your boss is giving you very little appreciation or acknowledgement, and what happens? This results in you becoming mentally distraught, physically depleted and possibly psychologically damaged. You don't feel or look as good as you used to. You might lose friends or family because frankly, your confidence is shot to, you know what? Um, and you feel like you're never right. You can't do, you can't do anything right yet work. You're afraid to propose new ideas. Um, uh, or share your point of view. You just become basically a mouse. Not, not cool. Not pretty. Uh, now, we want to ask ourselves, is this a problem worth fixing? Uh, am, I, am I otherwise happy in the marriage? Uh, should I fix this? Do I like this job? Does it have enough uh, perks and benefits that, that I, I should stand up for myself? Okay, in that case, uh, or should I cut my losses? <sighs> Plan what you want. What do you want the outcome to be? If you if you want to try to fix it, okay, what figure out the outcome that you want. Now that could be the firing of somebody. View these people with compassion and understand that they have their own saboteurs dealing with. And but understand that it is your time to shine. Okay. Now you, I suggest you read Dale Carnegie's How to Win Friends and Influence People. Um, it's an excellent book which will help you with your communication skills and understanding other people. You may want to try counseling. Uh, that's, that's always a good thing. However, n notice, if you're the only one doing the work on the relationship, whatever it is, uh, and there's no desire on the other uh, uh, to compromise or change, get out. And that's what we're talking about today. I'm saying bye-bye. Okay. How? do a complete split. Remove a, a rip the bandaid off, okay? Just leave and uh, re remove, and this is my way. Anyway, I, I just find it's easier this way. Remove all the memories of the person or the job, whatever it is, say goodbye to the work clothes. Uh, take time to grieve and then move forward as ASAP. Re so you'll regain your confidence, okay? and uh, just do it quickly and get it done. Get yourself back, it's time. Okay, Friday funny, which one do I wanna use? Uh, all right, which rock group has four men, one named John and another who was shot? 
rock group with four men, one named George and another who was shot. Mount Rushmore rock group. Can I? Oh, don't be so stone-faced. That joke was monumental. His face of granite. I'll tell you. That was a solid joke. Okay. Have a terrific weekend, everybody. Oh, that was courtesy of Darren Hardy. Have a terrific weekend. Bye for now.